Hello everybody, welcome back to unofficial commentary on Power Rangers Dino Supercharge. Apparently the Christmas special is set post-series. Let's go ahead and dig into Power Rangers Dino Supercharge episode 22, Here Comes Heximus. Let's begin right now. Wow, that is a new voiceover. And a new shot. Yep, it's set post-series, but why couldn't they have gotten the same guy to do it each time? Why does it end? How do you get a T-Rex to wear a hat like that? Maybe you guys... You, you guys clearly have a bunch of Christmas lights up already, and why the hell are you even using those? Follow instructions. And it was a trap. Of course it was. Why is Sledge here? He's supposed to be dead. Power Rangers, Power Rangers, Power Rangers, Power Rangers in a world full of strife. We must fight to survive. Try to break the chains that divide. There is only one chance to take the right stance. Hold tight, keep our power alive. Go, go, Power Rangers, don't you ever stop. Go, go, Power Rangers, you will rise up to the top. Rangers forever, Dino Charge all together. Power Rangers, Power Rangers, Power Rangers, Dino Charge. Snide was also in there, too. He's dead as well. Technically, he shouldn't exist anymore, but... This whole situation is a tiny bit weird. What? 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 Barry Allen is envious of how badly you've screwed up this timeline. That's a good damn question. And now he looks dumb. More than usual, I mean. Which is more... Which is more likely? He's screwing with you, or... That's happening, honestly. I have a rather distinct feeling that both of them are equally likely at this point. Oh, right, clip show time.
If that doesn't work, just suck him in the jaw. Maybe you could just... Oh, I don't know. Bring his dad in. Oh yeah, I remember this episode. That was kind of dumb. We don't have to see all this, you know. But I guess we do so we can pad out the run time. And it's frozen. I'm going to pause right here and hope that it actually decides to load up properly. Can't tell you how long in I am because Facebook only tells you how long is left. Let's uh, resume now with 15 minutes and 56 seconds left. There we go. Well, it's good to know the editors know some basic techniques for uh, masking transitions like that. No, we know. Oh, for the love of God. I didn't think that was... I thought that was a bad dream. Okay. She actually said that straight faced. Well, now we know that the show takes place over the course of about two years because they're saving Christmas again. Wow, those things are dumb. Grinders could outsmart these guys. I'll admit that was oh, that was kind of funny. Is that all the call?
Well, time for further clip shows. Why? There are plenty of sources of power in the universe. Why just the Energems? Oh, wow, well, that was a stupid stunt. I would love to see this episode without all of the clips. Please, please remind me of all the stupid shenanigans in the series. Remind me why I hate it. Well, this was good until that point. Conveniently keeping their hands off screen so that you can say that you cut it without actually doing much. Flashing back all the way to season one. <sighs> yeah, yes, please remind me of the stupidest moments of the entire series all in one episode. Please. Rake it in. You couldn't have done that. That was not physically possible. Mm -hmm. 
There are more people in Greece and Japan than just that. You know, I watched a little bit of Cure Uger. They were at least hinting that... Oh, hey. They were at least hinting that Daigo well, and Amy had actual chemistry from the very beginning. These guys? <laughs> no. Somebody who just does something like this so we could build a gimmick episode around it. Thank you. Thank you, Saban. Thank you. Thank you, Judd Lynn. Thank you, everybody on the freaking production team who didn't say this was a stupid idea. It was a rarity to get even one clip show a season back in the old days. Nowadays, you get even four a series. Probably cheap to make, but hey, roll the budget for those four into one episode and give us, like, more better episodes. And hell, cut the episode order down by, like, 12 Concentrate the budget elsewhere. Jesus Christ. Anyways, trying to resume right now. And we go. Why hasn't James said anything yet? Why isn't she morphing? With 65 million years of time... You should be able to come up with a better plan than and... More proof that the Dino Charge Rangers are weak sauce. The weakest of the weak sauce. How did you f get your saber? Oh, wait, they just summoned him. Clip show in the middle of a fight scene! Wonderful! Keep reminding me of how bad the direction was on this series. Remind me of the impossible things they keep pulling off. This isn't how it's supposed to... This was cringeworthy when we saw it originally. Not just cringeworthy, downright impossible. So yes, remind me of that. Th she was slashing horizontally and he blocked vertically. This is the most development their relationship had. In fact, it's... 
like what two three episodes of development out of the entire series okay we skip the fight scene in favor of this You don't need ten rangers to do that. One ranger could have handled... Uh, two rangers could have handled the Vivix, and one ranger could have just taken down Heximus and the... These guys. Where did you get the dino chargers from? Oh, well, I, people said the Operation Overdrive morph editing was weird. That... Why? Oh, right, so we can change between uh, American and Japanese footage less obviously. Or not, never mind. Victory maximum. Because we can't actually fight them right. Well, at least this was a Tyler focused episode and not a somebody and okay. How? How did you get the Magna Beam from there? I I would have bought it better if you'd have just stolen Rita Repulsa's staff and used it on yourself. You don't need an Ultra Zord to take down one monster, and Kendall is finally using her Zord. Thank you. I think it would be moot to ask where Spino is, but considering we managed to make it through the entire series and miss out on one of the coolest Rangers on the entire freaking roster... What? Why? 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 Why isn't? Why? Oh, why? What the heck? No. What? You know, I'd love to have a, a Zudenshi-sized version of that. All that ultimate attack wasted on... A clip shot and the same shot from the beginning of the episode. How did you get a Rudolph hat on a frickin' Brachiosaurus? And why is the Brachiosaurus getting along with the frickin' T-Rex? Why? You know? And... Dumb antics. Again. It's really not all that unbelievable, but for the love of God, did they have to have the freaking pratfalls? Falls?